Hi, this is Eric, EJ's Cigar Box Guitars. I had just done a video with this guitar, so I've modified it. I took out the tone knob and I installed a psycho knob. Uh, if you look back, I've made distortion boxes using them. I also did a four string cigar box guitar that has a humbucker and a single coil. It's a blue guitar. I put one in there. This is the first time putting one in where it's disguised. So what it is, is it's, it's basically a circuit board that gives you four levels of distortion. So you don't need a distortion pedal. Especially if you're playing through a PA system or you're busking, you don't want a bunch of pedals. You want a guitar and an amp, that's it. This would give you distortion. So, on the back, we have a battery. It does require a 9 volt battery. If you are using one in a cigar box amplifier or a distortion box, the di the psycho knob requires its own battery. You cannot share batteries. So I'll show you here. I'm going through my Roland cube this time. So we'll do this, do this. Okay, so I won't go through all the settings. The only thing that's going to be different will be the single coil. Like if you go through here, you, know, you have those, you have your coil split still, all that's unchanged. So if I go here, so we've got the coil splitting. So if the battery's dead, you will still pass through. You don't need a battery if you're leaving this turned off. Then you got level one. Level two. Level three. And level four. Right there. So you can hear it coming on there. So they look like normal knobs, but they're not. So this is why you don't put your foot on your amplifier. If it's dead or you don't plan on using it, you don't want to have a battery in there, you can still pass through. But if you want distortion, you need a 9 volt battery. So we got coil splitting, we got psycho knob. This is because of the size of the chip, I had to adjust this and move it over slightly to get it to fit. The only alternative would have been drill the large hole 
in the back, feed it through the back. And I didn't want to get into that stuff. So. But you could have. They're easier if you're putting them into something that has an actual pick guard or one that has a panel in the back, like some of the Yamahas, like Ibanez, Gibsons, where you have a panel. But I didn't want to put one in. So, like usual, I'm on Facebook, Instagram, Kijiji, eBay, TikTok, Clapper, YouTube. Like, share, comment, subscribe, and all that good shit. Have a good day.